Hey guys, how's it going? Back for another video. Um, so if you saw my birthday big 12 by 36 inch um, Dutch pour, um, that was on my birthday on Friday and I had a great time. Um, so it's now dry. I'll show you guys. I showed it to you in the last video, but in case you didn't see the last video, um, here it is. So she is dry got some nice shimmer and shine to it so on Friday when I released the video to this 12 by 36 inch piece I had a ton of people um, email me um, wanting to purchase it one lucky lovely lady um, ended up buying it and so um, for the rest of you who didn't um, get the chance to buy it I did mention that um, I could do the same thing using the same colors. Now, of course, it's not going to look exactly like that one because we all know it's impossible to duplicate any pour ever, um, but I can definitely use the same colors. So um, I had a lovely lady um, commission a piece for me for a 12 by 24 inch um, instead of 36 inch. Um, the exact same colors, the exact same everything, just smaller size. So. Let's see, can we make it happen and duplicate as close as possible to the birthday pour? So let's give it a shot and see what happens. Let me bring you guys down. Oh, let me cover that. So I'll bring you down without knocking you over. All right, are we good? We're good. Okay, so I have a 12 by 24 inch canvas here. Um, you might be seeing some puddles. Actually, let me see if I can show you. Um, I just did a previous pour. You can see I have a pretty cool skins under there. Um, and I have another one just off uh, camera view just over here um, of beautiful colors. Um, if you saw my previous video, you'll know what I'm talking about. So, um, they're here on my awesome lowly Veffy mat. Um, for those of you, I know this may sound repetitive to all my, um, you know, subscribers who watch me religiously. <laughs> um, but yes, I do love the lowly Veffy mats, guys. They are some seriously cool um, silicone mats. So the link is in the description below. Um, check out the previous video where I show you some of the skins that dried from the birthday pour. If you haven't seen it, check it out. Um, and just if you do click on the link and buy a mat, um, use the code CANELA5. So my name and the number five and you can get $5 off and it's free shipping in the US. So there you go. Um, all right, I've already covered my canvas in white, which is in this bottle, which is Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White with Floetrol and water. And as you can see, I have my colors lined up right here. I'm gonna use the exact same colors. So we have Thalo Blue by uh, Grumbacher Academy and then Iridescent Blue Green by Pebeo Studio Acrylics, Dioxazine Purple by Liquitex Basics, Thalo Green by Academy or Grumbacher, um, Greenish Blue by Amsterdam, and then we have Iridescent Green Blue by Pebeo Studio Acrylics and Permanent Red Violet by Amsterdam. And they're gonna go in exactly that order, just like I did in the birthday pour. Um, so let's get started and see if I can uh, make it look just as beautiful as the uh, birthday pour. So let's get started with the uh, Thalo Blue. So if you didn't see um, my previous video, I talked about my awesome surprise birthday party that my husband had planned for me, although it wasn't really much of a surprise because I had a feeling something was going on. Um, so if you didn't see the previous video, check it out because um, I talk about what happened this weekend. There's no sense in repeating myself because those of you who already, already watched the video don't want to hear it again. <laughs> Um, but it was a great time. We had a blast. Um, great, great party. So, and now back to reality. And I don't feel older. It's just another day. 
it's just another birthday it's just a number right so I don't feel any different so I guess that's a good thing right <laughs> maybe I'll start feeling it you know in a couple of months <laughs> Oh uh, man, so what day is it today? Today is, um, oh, it's Monday. It's Monday. So I haven't um, poured whew, since last week, actually. Um, so it's been quite a bit. Um, I'm excited this weekend. I have another um, uh, workshop going on, so that's exciting. I've got people coming. I have eight uh, lovely ladies coming to my workshop at my home uh, on uh, Sunday morning. So we're going to be doing some uh, Dutch pours and some uh, probably some tree ring pours. But uh, if you're in my area or GTA, you know, give or take an hour or two away or whatever. I am planning on doing um, another workshop. I'm going to try and do one in October. Um, so if you are interested in uh, doing a workshop here with me in Innisfil, which is just um, south of Barrie, Ontario, um, leave a comment below or uh, email me. My email is in the description below. Um, so feel free to email me. And when I get my dates set up or figure out what day I'm going to do it, I will let you know um, and give you any other details like uh, date, time, pricing, all that stuff. So I will do another one. I just got to figure out when. All right, so I've poured my white. I'm going to torch the bubbles because there's lots of bubbles in here. All right, let's blow it over now. All right, I've blown it over and I look down and I realize something. Can you hear me very well? Maybe you can, maybe you can't, but guess who forgot to plug in the microphone? I unplugged it after my last pour. Ugh, what a dunce. All right, let me plug it in. Hopefully this makes a difference. Can you hear me better? Oh my gosh, sorry guys. I did not realize I did not have that plugged in. I hope you can hear me better now. And if you couldn't hear me before, I'm really sorry about that. I totally forgot to plug that in. All right, so I've blown the white over. And so we all know how much I love blowing halfway and halfway. So let's keep with that because it seems to work very well for me. And let's see where we end up. Well, I'm looking at that one down there and I'm looking at this one and I'm loving it. I'm, I love the phthalo green, guys. Like, I mean, it really looks um, stunning in here. It adds such a nice um, contrasting color. I'm really liking this. Um, I think the only thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut this corner off here and maybe this one here. Where's my scraper? All right, because I want to have, I want it to match um, negative space. So I'm just going to just do that. This is why I love the scraper too, which you get um, for free. Um, if you order the mat, Adriana will send you um, a scraper, which is great. Um, it's great for scraping 
your canvas or your silicone mat clean. Um, also for scraping your canvas if need be clearly like I just did right now. So that's better. All right, so now that I've scraped it, I've got some hard lines here, which I'm just gonna blow. Okay, I like that. And then this part right here, I'm gonna scrape a little bit, just like that, there. And then I will add my white. And this is why I really like squeeze bottles too, um, because it's really easy um, to add white where you need it. Um, you know, if you wanna be precise and accurate with where you're adding it. So just like that, easy peasy. I'm just gonna give it a quick blow. There you go. Uh, my paper towel blew off the table. All right, so I'm liking that a lot. I think it turned out gorgeous. And I'm just gonna torch the outsides and see what pops up. What's hiding underneath. I like it, just like that, as I torch some more. Just the edges, I like doing the edges. I've, I've decided to start leaving the center, which I'm really liking, because again, that iridescent from Pebeo leaves some really cool looking cells. So I'm really liking that. All right, so let me bring you guys in for a close up. And you tell me, here I'll show you, without, oh my God, me doing anything bad. You tell me, how similar does it look? Birthday pour, duplicate pour. Birthday pour, duplicate pour. <laughs> so let me know what you guys think. Let me bring you guys down for a close up. Oh, I'm losing it. I need some sleep, clearly. All right, so what do you guys think? Was uh, I able to uh, pretty much duplicate the uh, birthday pour here? So you can see some pretty cool cells that formed with the iridescent. See, look at that. With the iridescent blue, green, and green, blue. And once again, there's that phthalo green. I'm loving. See, look at that phthalo green. So pretty. And then it's down here as well. Look at that. So guys, anyone who wanted the birthday Dutch pour and you know you weren't lucky enough to purchase it uh, and you want something similar, it can be done. Um, if you're interested, let me know. Uh, my email is listed below. Um, feel free to email me um, and I'll get back to you. But in the meantime, let me know what you guys think about this one. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments if you think uh, I did a good job on pretty much trying to copy the other one and for those of you who are new watching don't forget to hit that subscribe bell or no hit the subscribe button and click on that notification bell that way you're notified every time I post a new video and I have all my social media links below as well as well as um, my Amazon shop links all my supplies torches the spatula which is the large spatula by the way not the mini spatula it's the large spatula um, a lot of people ask me what I use. Um, it's a tripod. It's actually a selfie stick. I use that. Um, so yeah, but I don't want to put it back on the table. It's going to fall, so let's just throw it down there. But yeah, everything is listed in the Amazon shops and my PayPal link, guys, for anyone who would like to donate. Every little bit helps. It helps me buy supplies um, so that I can show you guys my pores. There's my other one. It's just just did it right before I did this one. So it's on that side, drying or soaking wet, but you know. 
Um, and that's it guys. And don't forget to take your popsicle stick and run it along the bottom to catch and um, scrape off all the drips. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Have a good night. Bye. He's going in circles. <laughs>